Hey, 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 this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Ultimate Fishing Simulator. And we are here at Betty Lake at the moment, but guys, we're going to check out a different lake this time. Now, normally, being level 7, we wouldn't have the option of doing this. But since this is the demo version, we can go to another lake. Now, normally, it would take a level 9 to get to this lake, and this is Penis Bay. Actually, it's not a lake at all. It is deep sea fishing. Now this is going to be very interesting because we've got three whole new species that are going to be introduced. The Dorado or the Dolphin type fish, the Greater Amberjack, and the Rainbow Runner. Now we're going to go ahead and take a look at this map and see what we can see. But We actually have a boat that we can operate out here too guys. So let's go check it out. Alright guys, here we go, and we are starting off at this little, looks like a nice little place to stay there. But what we're going to do is we're going to come down here, now you can go off to the side and fish, or you can go out on the dock, and I think at the moment I'm going to go out on the side here. i run over here and do a little fishing off this shore here, and you can go out in the water somewhat. Now the sun is a little bit bright because it is early morning. And let me go ahead and see what we have as far as our baits go. Alright, we have got... Oh boy, I'm having a hard time seeing that. The current lure that we have on here is a spinner. And I think we're going to continue to use that because it is good for the Dorado, the Greater Amberjack, the Rainbow Runner, and we're going to just see how it works with this one for the moment. So let's give it a test run here. All right, let's throw that thing out there and see if there's anything that's going to bite. I see some activity out there. There are some fish swimming around and about. So I think with this I'm going to go ahead and try a, let me get the real speed down here. I'm going to try a slow retrieve, just kind of stop and pause every now and then. Try that first, if that doesn't work we'll go to something else. Look from the camera point of view here. So far, I haven't caught anything's attention. But there are fish here. Not sure they're going for the stop and go. We may have to try a different approach here. Let's just try slow and steady here. Yeah, we're just going to try us a slight, straight slow. Looks like we're getting. Look at that. See, it does the dots too. Ooh, I got a bite. Got a bite. What do we got here? Looks like a... I'm not sure. I can't really tell. <laughs> it 
might be a greater amberjack. I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and get the other camera view back. Oh, doggone it. I was messing around. That's the only thing about using that camera view. Sometimes you can't... You can't really see what you're trying to do with the reel. That's the only thing I've... My only complaint about it is you really got to watch that. There's also a little too much glare. There we go. Alright, we're going to let him take it a little bit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't you even think about it, Mr. Fish. Okay, he's decent size, guys. He's decent size. We'll wear him down. We'll wear him down. We're just going to do a little bit at a time. May have to take the tension down just a little bit again. Yeah, this is a test of your fishing skills here. Whether or not he can get away. We're going to need to start getting this guy in because if he doesn't... Okay, he is still making... Okay, he's, he's getting tired now. This is where we got to play him in. He's going to try to make a couple of runs for it, but... I think we got him this time. Now when it drops about halfway, then I say just start reeling. Just keep an eye on that. Make sure it doesn't go too high up in th into the red. But we are making progress. bring the rod up, keep the rod up like this. I'm sorry my dog wants to go out because he can't make his mind up whether he wants to be in with me or out there with his my wife. As soon as I let him out with my wife he wants to go back in here again. <laughs> Alright, come on. Yeah, he was out quite a way so this isn't going to be quick. Alright, we're going to take this up another notch and we're going to muscle this guy in now. Played around with him long enough. Played around with this guy long enough. That's all there is to it. Come on in here, you. We're done playing with you. Yeah, he's almost there now. Don't you think you're going to make one more damn run? I'll show you what for, you crazy fish. Pull your finny butt in here. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. Big old fish. Big old fish. Come on. And there we go. A greater amberjack. Nice big fish. He is 51.49 pounds, guys. He brings in $234 cash. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and sell him. Going to go ahead and sell that guy. All right. Now you got a chance to see what it is to get a greater amber amberjack from the beach. Let's come over here and get on the dock here for a second. 
Now you can fish anywhere along here on along the beach. Yeah, you might have your preferences of areas and locations, but and you can also fish off the dock. Alright, but we are gonna go out here and we're gonna get on this boat. Cause I want to get on the boat. I'm also probably gonna change my baits. Okay, this is taking a little long. We're gonna move it on here. So you got your little fishing hut out here and can't really do anything, it's just more for aesthetic aesthetic purposes. But anyway, you basically can come out here and turn and you just enter the boat. And as you can see it has a fish finder, which is pretty cool. But you just use the WASD keys. And I don't know if you can see those boys, but you can't go any further than those boys. We're gonna go over here. Crash to this boat. No, we're not gonna crash. We're going to come out here just a little bit deeper, and then we're going to go ahead and start fishing all the way out here. Now this is the cool thing, guys. You can come out here and you can fish in different locations off the, the boat as well, which is pretty awesome. But I am going to try, let's see. Can I get up there? I think I can. Maybe I can't. Going set? Nope. Whoa, wait a minute. Okay, how did I do that? Oh, I somehow disembarked from the boat. <laughs> Sorry about that. I did not mean to do that. Well, I still want to go out here a little bit deeper. Like I said, you don't want to go beyond these bulls. If you do, nothing bad will happen. It'll just tell you that you can't go that far. <clears throat> there we go. Alright. So what should we use, guys? Should we use what we've got or do something different? Alright, let's try let's try one of our spoons. I'll go ahead and equip that. Cause I usually have a lot of luck with spoons, always have. Oop, apparently I can't throw it that far. Yep, that's the boundary, you can't throw it that far. Interesting. Should be able to throw it this way though. There we go. Now we're going to kick up the speed on this a notch because we're going to do a lift and drop here. Might want to take that tension down. Yeah, it's in some deep, deep water here. So what I'm hoping to get is one of those dolphins, or dorados. Whoa, okay, don't you even think about it, Mr. Fran Miss my friend. My friend. Come in here, you little bugger. You little bugger, come on. Yeah, I think there's a certain distance they can go out and they'll get off your line. So you don't want them to get too far out either. So you're kind of competing against not only them breaking the line, but also getting too far out. So Okay, he's, he's slowing down a little bit. Yep. 
Yeah, we've got him this we've got him guys. We've got him. Just gotta be patient. Yeah, this is different than what I had before. This could be Could be one of the other fish. I don't know. We'll see. Alright guys, we've almost got him in here. I'm kinda curious to see what he is. I think it's another greater amberjack. I can't what I can see, that's what it looks like. Come on. Nope, it's a rainbow runner. That's what a rainbow runner looks like. And he brings in two hundred and thirteen dollars. Not bad. All right, we're going to change tactics here again, just for giggles. I am going to do some float fishing this time. So we need to put a float into place. Well, first of all, we got to get rid of that large hook. It's not so shiny. go over here to this part of the fish from over here and we'll just wait and see if anything gets interested Look, guys, there it comes. Ah, that was a Dolph, Dolph, Dorado, too. That was a Dorado. I've been wanting to get one of those. I've caught everything but that, and I really have had a hankering to catch one of these. Okay, something's coming in. Don't know that he's gonna. No, he's. Oh, there we go. We got us a definite interested party there. Make sure he takes it. He got it. Oh, don't you little bugger! Come here! Don't you even think about it! Come on! I was hoping to get a Dorado, but. I'll take you. Ooh, I went the wrong darn way, didn't I? Oh, oh, don't you even think about it. He was trying hard to break that line. He's getting a little bit too far. If he gets too far, he can escape. Okay, no. I got him. I got him. Let's kick this thing into gear and get this goof head in here. Back off a little bit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on. Yeah, we got him. Another rainbow runner. We'll sell him. Getting cash in this is not hard, guys. Not hard in the least. But we. I'm going to try one more time to get one of those Dorados. Then we'll call this an episode. Hopefully, I will say this, if you wiggle it like this back and forth with your mouse, it does seem to get attention. And doing it kind of deep seems to help too.
There he is. Come on, you little bugger. I got him, guys. I got him. I got him. Yeah. <laughs> I got him. Okay. I think I got him. <laughs> Come on. He is. He's a. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, 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 okay. You're cool. You can have it for a little bit. Oh, he is. He is one powerful son of a gun. We're going to have to put a stop to that soon or he's going to get away. Shoot, he escaped. See, that's what I'm talking about, guys. If they get too far, they get loose. Daggone it. He's a powerful son of a gun. He is a powerful son of a gun. Well, at least you got to see one. Yeah, this is getting a little bit long here, guys. But anyway, if you want to get back to the the dock, it's real easy. All you have to do is go over here, and then you're off on the dock again. Anyway, this is Panas Bay, and it is quite a cool place to do some fishing. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And always remember, guys, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. I will see you later. Bye-bye.